Uh, Premier League matches of the week. Man City going to defeat Liverpool with their 31st points of the season. It is Man City. That's Camacho 31. Uh, Jurgen Klopp as Liverpool manager would lose his 78th match as a manager by losing to Erling Bro Holland. Erling Bro Holland is Camacho 78. Uh, Liverpool to lose. Uh, Liverpool to uh, remain at 27 points. They enter, they enter at 27 against Man City. It's red. That's Camacho 27. The Reds of uh, Liverpool. Uh, so Liverpool are going to lose against uh, Manchester City. The City with their 21st uh, goal differential. City is 21. Title is 21. If Liverpool score first, it is uh, red sets 19. If uh, Man City's goal differential could fall to 19. So I like uh, Manchester City to win at home against Liverpool. Remember, the Liverpool fans booed the anthem uh, after the Queen's death. So it's it's all going to go awfully wrong for Liverpool. By the numbers, by the Masons, they could allow their 19th goal against Pep. It is uh, Pep, that's Camacho, 19. Uh, by the numbers, by the Freemasons, by the 33 degrees of masonry, Liverpool can fall to three draws and three losses. They would fall to 13 wins and three losses. That's kind of the gamacha of Liverpool FC. Three wi 13 wins for the year, three losses. By the Masons, it's lined up very well for a Man City win. And then we can go to... Uh, we can go to Man City. Liverpool FC is uh, under 33. They enter with uh, 13 wins and 3 losses. They could get their... They enter at 46 goals against the Reds. That's how that match was rigged against Chelsea. Uh, Reds is Gamatria of uh, 46. And so uh, we uh, we continue, we continue, and uh, we go back here to the uh, to the Premier League table. Uh, Man City they can score their thirty fourth goal against the Reds. The Reds is Camacho thirty four. So if they win a two one something like that, I can see that thirty fourth goal against Liverpool. So Man City can get the victory for their thirty first points of the year. Arsenal are going to defeat Brentford. There's going to be no problems there. Three draws, one loss. That's kind of the Gamacho Man City. You know, they're competing to win the Premier League title with uh, Man City. Nothing really stands out with Brentford, per se. But Arsenal jump into second. Bees is Gamacha 31. The Brentford Bees. Three draws, one loss. Arsenal jump in the second place with 30 points. Man City get their 30th points against Liverpool. And Jurgen Klopp. You know, 29, 30, and 31. Jurgen is 30. He did help Liverpool win their first Premier League title in uh, 30 years. So, overall... Arsenal to jump in the second. They're one point behind Man City. You know, it's it's never uh, a guarantee to, you know, predict Tottenham to, 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 to win. I mean, Aston Villa, uh, Tottenham, uh, the thing about them is that if they do win, they could go for two draws and three losses when they lose the City because they're not going to beat City. Holland is 23. Right, it's between Arsenal and City. City going to be very hard to... Uh, to stop to win against so uh right there i'll go with tottenham to win they're kind of still behind arsenal there um man united and uh, everton it's sean dyke that can go for his 13th win against man u because man u is uh gamachi at 13 however man united seven wins six losses 
Toffees is Camacho 76. Now remember, their last Premier League loss was against Man City. Man City's 85. So, you know, the most likely outlook for Man United, they're eight wins and five losses. And they could have eight wins and six losses after they lose to Saudi Arabia. Just which team are they going to beat? They're going to beat... Which team are they going to lose to? They're going to lose to Newcastle between uh, Everton and uh, Newcastle. So the, I, that's kind of the outlook that I see for Man United there in the next couple of weeks. Everton, two draws, seven losses. Sean Dyke is the manager. Dyke is uh, Gamacho 27. Uh, Everton, I think, have done very well in, uh, in recent weeks. Right, so I got to go with... Uh, Monday night to defeat Everton. The, the gap is still five between Tottenham and Man United. This would make the Man United uh, Newcastle match interesting. Now Chelsea have been red hot. Uh, Newcastle, um, they are dealing with an injury crisis. Uh, Newcastle and uh, Chelsea. Uh, yeah, that one is going to be a very very tight one. It is. It's going to be very, very good. I could probably see a draw with this one, to be honest. Magpies is 34, three draws, four losses. So if they have 21, whatever, and Chelsea, they, they, they pick up a result. So very skeptical of that one right now, but that one could end up being a draw. Now, I think the answer is going to lie with now, anyhow, 24 losses, 24 draws, just poach is 24. So, just looking at that right there, uh, let's, you know, go to uh, Newcastle quickly, see how everything stacks up uh, for the Magpies. Chelsea FC is 35. They have 35 goals. The scripted 2 0 loss to Aston Villa. I, I lean draw with this one. 